Oh, YouTube, hi! I wasn't expecting you. If I had known you were coming, I would have had a well-needed haircut. And a shave. Ugh. Oh, but still, welcome back to the Man Cave for Operation YouTube Money. I was actually just picking out a fairy tale to read to you guys. After I flushed everything out in my last video, I think it's time for some positivity. Something I can show to the children of the internet and make this a channel for everyone. A family channel. A channel you can watch with your parents. A channel you can watch with your priest. A channel you can watch with your annoying kid sister. I actually found a fairy tale I think you may like. The Five Little Ducks by... Oh! By Curtis Petrie. This should be good. Once upon a time... There were five little ducks. One day, the five little ducks approached their mother and said, Mama, can we go out to play? Over the hills and far away. The mother duck said, Oof, over the hills? Can't you play on this side of the hills where I can see you? And the duck said, God, Mom, get off our case. We're just going to go play some tag with the geese from across the pond. All right, the mother duck said, as long as you're home in time for supper. So the five little ducks went out to play over the hills and far away. Supper time came, and the ducks had still not returned from their game of tag with the geese. The mother duck yelled, Quack, 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 and four of the five little ducks came back. The mother duck said, Where is your younger brother? And the duck said, He was just here a minute ago. Don't worry, Mom, he'll come back. The four little ducks went inside, and the fifth duck never did come back. The next day, the four little ducks approached their mother and said, Mother, can we go out to play over the hills and far away? The mother duck said, Last time you went over the hills, you lost one of your brothers. And the little duck said, Oh no, we're going to look for him. So the mother duck said, Well, be sure to look for your brother and be back in time for supper. So the four little ducks went off to play over the hills and far away. Supper time came, and the ducks had still not returned. The mother duck yelled, Quack, quack. Quack, quack, and three of the four little ducks came back. Are you serious, the mother said. I send you out to find a sibling and you lose another one. And the duck said, oh, we didn't notice. Don't worry, Mom, we'll look for both of them tomorrow. Not over the hills, you're not, shouted their mother. And the duck said, Mom, you're blowing this way out of proportion. We'll look for them tomorrow after we play with the geese. So the next day, the three little ducks went out to play over the hills and far away. The mother duck yelled, quack, 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 and two of the three little ducks came back. That's it, yelled their mother. No more playing over the hills for you. I told you it was bad news. Those geese you spend so much time with are horrible influences on all of you. Shut up, mom! Those geese are our friends, and if losing a sibling or two or three is the price to pay for friendship, then so be it! The next day, the two little ducks awoke with the sun and snuck into their mother's room while she slept. They whispered to her, Mama, can we go out to play over the hills and far away? Okay, thank you, bye. When their mother awoke, she noticed they had left. She stormed outside and yelled, Quack, 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 quack. And one of the two little ducks came back. Before she could even open her bill, the duck said, Yeah, yeah, I know. You really shouldn't have let us go that second time. That's just bad parenting, Mom. Bad parenting. The next morning, the little duck stormed through the house and booted open the front door. Where do you think you're going, yelled Mother Duck. And the little duck said, To find my brothers. Morning passed, as did the afternoon. The sun was setting when the mother duck yelled, Quack, 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 quack. And none of the five little ducks came back. No little ducks went out the next day, over the hills, and far away. The mother duck yelled, quack, 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 and a police car drove up the driveway. A policeman stepped out of the car and asked, You Mrs. Duck? I am, she answered. The policeman then asked, You got five little ducks? I do, she answered. You have to come to the morgue and identify some bodies. So the mother duck went to the morgue and found five little duck tables with five little duck sheets covering the bodies of her five little ducks. She 
She removed the first sheet. This is my youngest duck, she said. She removed more. This is my second duck, and my third, and my fourth. She then approached the table that held the body of her eldest duck. Fond memories of raising him and watching him play with his siblings raced through her mind. She held the corner of the sheet and pulled it back over his little duck face and... Surprise! The five little ducks jumped up and yelled at the top of their lungs. We got you, mommy, they shouted as their policeman accomplice chuckled to himself in the corner. <laughs> you little ducks, he said. <laughs> the mother duck, shocked and struggling to breathe, had a heart attack and died. The five little ducks spent the rest of their young lives moving foster home to foster home, where they were raped and locked in closets for days on end with nothing to eat but their own feces. I didn't even say fuck in this video.